would you choose a corporate executor? And in particular, why would you choose F&M Trust as your corporate executor? Now we have a lot of advantages here in our particular institution. We have been a trust company as long as we've been a bank. So we have a particular department that does nothing but settle estates. We have the expertise to make sure that paperwork is done when it needs to be done and all the forms that need to be done. So often we'll find that there's no surviving children or no surviving family members that want to take that kind of duty on. That's when people will name F&M as their corporate executor. Um, the family members aren't nearby. The burden on the family members if they have small children. You know, we have a lot of sandwich generation right now where mom and dad is here, 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 you're raising children, your children may have grandchildren. Oftentimes, unfortunately, uh, siblings, cousins, people involved in the administration of the will, they have a tendency to develop some claws. You know, there may be people that have gotten along for years say, well, mom wanted me to have that, well, I should have had that etc etc as a corporate executor there's no human contact there's no we grew up together we are bound by the document so you can take the emotions out of it we're not involved we don't get emotionally involved that way we have the ability to do all the receipts and the disbursements and run them through so it's a clear concise process the beneficiaries the, what would be the executor if we were the administrator in that particular case, all get an accounting as the estate goes through the process, typically on a monthly to quarterly basis, depending upon the complexity of the estate. They always know what's going on. As an administrator, the executor will be signing off on each, uh, on each and every item. So we can facilitate the paperwork. And the distribution of the assets are always according to the terms of the will. Whether there's a codicil stuck in there with grandma's signature on it, you know, that's dated and signed by grandma, that again can be part of the will. So we would handle that. That's one, one of the reasons why you want to look at a corporate executor. We deal with social security as far as when that last social security check would have to go back, what the pension benefits are, we line up the paperwork and get a hold of those beneficiaries. Uh, we would meet with family members and sit down and do basically a reading of the will and say, this is what we are in charge of doing for you. Then they go and do an accounting of all property. All property, whether it be the vase, whether it be the car, whether it be the horse out back. They go through and they do an entire accounting of the property. We secure, if there's a property left, we go out and secure that property. The locks will be changed, there'll be a real litter lock on it, that kind of thing we go through. We have to make sure in the meantime, the electric bill is paid, that the lawn is maintained, that the taxes are up to date, all of those pieces so that it just doesn't go into limbo. So we handle all of those pieces for you as well. We will put the notices in the newspaper. There always has to be some type of death notice in the newspaper in addition to just the obituary. The obituary is one piece, but the executor notice is another. That executor notice is the official notice that any creditors have one year from this notice date to make sure any bills are forwarded to the executor on file. There's Typically there's hospital bills afterwards. And going through, if there's Medicare involved, going through that process, going back to the doctor in charge, going back through their billing situation, they have one year from the date of that notice to make sure that any bills that they have coming due to them are put in, otherwise they are excluded from the estate. Typically it does take about a year to settle an estate, even a fairly simple one because of the time parameters involved.